Mm-hmm. Um, throughout the 80s and into the 90s and even up to this day, he's managed to stay modern and relevant, at least in their eyes. Uh, Madonna. That's true. She is. She never retired. She never took a break. She's always out there doing stuff. And her singing is still pretty good. Yeah. The only I do recall. I do remember a friend of mine um, from back in college. She once shared with me her experience going to a Madonna concert, and she did respond and talked about how weird it was that at one point in the middle of the like in between her songs. She ended up doing like a lecture about religion or something, or about like God and free spirits and praying. No, oh. I was surprised to hear that. It's like you're there for the music, and then all of a sudden she gives a. It's like she's giving a, like a lecture or like a, what do you call it? Um, what are those things called? Work a workshop of <laughs> of some sort. It's like it goes Luckily. from uh, con- It goes from concert to TED talk. Only yeah. difference is <laughs> exactly. uh, TED Talks tend to actually bring up some pretty interesting ish topics. Where mm. a concert, you're norm, you are normally there for the music. Right, you're there for entertainment, not not for education. <laughs> I mean, I could see what she was trying to do, and if she was trying to like educate people or bring something of important value to them, at least important to her eyes, but. Yeah, but either way, going back to what you were talking about, yeah, she is always busy. She's always doing stuff professionally. The only thing I really questioned in the last few years, this is when she did a duet with Nicki Minaj, which at that point, warning warning flags were raising in my head already. I thought, oh, no, no good will come with this. Um, well, she's got to stay relevant. She's got to be – she's got to – Hook up with what the kids are into, who the kids are into. When I saw probably about 20 to 30 seconds of the music video in question, um, is where she's dressing and acting like Nikki, which I thought, well, okay, first of all, nobody at Nikki's age should be acting like her anyway. So that's, again, that's warning flags again already. But it was the title of the song that threw me. And I quote, bitch, I'm Madonna. Oh. Uh, I'm Jesus. Like, I mean, if Madonna was doing this um, circa 1983 when she was mid-20s, I'd say, okay. But you're three years south of 60. Um, mm-hmm. You know, I'm not one for being ageist and say people can't do anything they want to within reason. But I looked at that and I'm like, girl, no, just no. And then there was that whole incident with Drake that uh, he didn't take too kindly to. He, uh, um, I, I don't know whether this was part of her act yeah, she uh, played tonsil tennis with him on stage. Hmm. And then he's probably the, gonna give him a lap dance. She's all like, "Oh, get off!" Like, oh, oh, oh. I think oh, I remember. Good, Madonna. Madonna. Thanks. You mentioned something telling her to put a freaking cardigan on. Uh, I think that was bad. I think for one magazine. Uh, she actually purposely wanted to do a topless shoot at 56. I'm like, okay, girl, stop. No. Yeah, who are you, Janet Jackson? Oh, let's not be reminded of that. <laughs> oh, good. Please, Madonna isn't exposing her nipple on accident. Oh, God, wait, wait, let's not give her ideas. Never mind. Quote unquote, accident. And then there was the whole thing. Um, oh, apparently for one of her live tours recently, she um, she irked a few people where, as part of her act, she would have pole dancing nuns. I'm like, oh, girl, no. Had to no. stay relevant. <laughs> there's being yeah. relevant and there's being stupid. Whatever yeah. gets your name <laughs> in the head. Whatever gets your name in the headlines. 
I guess. Yeah, Sadly. the risky nuns didn't work for Hitman Absolution for some. Uh, it's not going to work for your music. No. Ugh. Maybe she just think. Maybe she's like like several like many celebrities. They reach that point in their lives where, or they reach like that kind of mentality where they're so famous they can get whatever they want. Their resources are unlimited. They think I can do no wrong. I can do anything. Uh, no. In this case, I again, I like Madonna's earlier music, but it feels like she, it sounds like she's trying way too hard. A Pokemon go to the polls moment. Oh, say. God, that was so crazy. Did she do that? Pardon? I said, uh, did she do that? Uh, no, the Pokemon go to the polls thing was done by Hillary Clinton okay. during the campaign, uh, oh. which is, it's relevant because it's someone kind of older trying to reach out to the younger crowd and the attempt to reach out the younger crowd failing miserably. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know, I have not heard, I don't know about this Pokemon Go, but maybe the po the verse should Pokemon Go to the polls. It's like, it's like. No. Stop. 